All right, coming up next, it is a welterweight showdown between the Nigerian nightmare Kamaru Usman and George Rush St. Pierre. All right, so the fight is now underway. On one side, you have a fighter who does everything well, taking on a true grappler on the other side. Going to be interesting to see how long he can keep it up. I mean, Damian Maya may be the most specialist type of grappler in the UFC. This guy resembles him in a number of ways. Let's see how he manages this fight against a guy that can do just about everything inside the octagon. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. <laughs> well, certainly not just a wrestler as the champion Usman shows his boxing chops there, DC. Beautiful combo. Yeah, Henry Huth has done a fantastic job with him. He's a pupil of Henry. Henry's taking him under his wing. He's taking the time to build this young... Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. It's the shoulder pressure that usually makes you tap. Oh, nice job, Houston, and he's out. Nicely done there as he forces the miss from his opponent. Under three minutes to go in round one. St. Pierre's got an arm. Looks like he's trying to lock up a Kimura. The Kimura's not the arm. It's the shoulder pressure that usually makes you tap. But now DC trying to isolate an arm. Yep, he's using the Kimura. Oh! Get the turn on the elbow, and he's going to change the submission. Sheer will is, is really remarkable to watch. All right, working inside the closed guard now. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. 